want to go the other way. Going this way, I'm leaving, and the second I get outside, I am fast traveling the hell out of here. In here. Bunch of food. get it that time. Hmm. Sounds like you had fun. on the street is Golden Glow's been hit. Good job, lad. Let me take a look at what you found. Arengarth sold Golden Glow? What's that idiot thinking? He has no idea the extent of Maven's fury when she's been cut out of a deal. But I'm certain he'll find out. If only the parchment had the buyer's name instead of this odd symbol. Any idea what that might be? Blast. Well, I'll check my sources and speak to Mercer. But for now, you're off to speak to Maven Blackfriar. She asked for you by name. <laughs> if it was like that, she wouldn't be asking for you. She'd be calling on the Dark Brotherhood. It's just business. That's between you and Maven. And I prefer to keep it that way. Don't worry about it. Maven's business dealings usually involve quite a bit of gold for her people. <laughs> of course, your pay. <laughs> You're smart as a whiplock. Keep doing right by us, and there's plenty more where that came from. Until next we meet, lad. than disturb me. <clears throat> Maven wants to get away. I suggest you head right over.
sure have quite a good bit of jobs available, if you're looking for some extra coin. Even if you're one of them, you better not make trouble. I'll give a word. Well, well. I was looking for this little beauty. If you happen to cross any other unusual trinkets like this, be sure to bring them to me. I promise it'll be worth the effort. There you go. This should cover it. What's the matter? Right to get your hands dirty. Welcome to the cozy little fa- I've got coin and I've got merchandise. Let's see what we can do. Now, if you'll excuse me. Need a few spare septums? I got the cure right here. So, you're Brynjolf's new protege, eh? Don't look like No! Damn it. Didn't mean to go in here. Kind of like they also didn't have much, so couldn't really know much. sure that I can oh I forgot that closed I want to make sure that okay I'm sorry that was loud that's the only reason why I got quiet real quick no I, I want to okay uh, let me go around I guess uh, what mission am I on actually yeah I'll speak with her and then I'll work with the graybeards and such and such and such um but I know I think I'll talk with the graybeards but uh, I mean I need to make sure that I can save all of it people of Ripton heed my words the return of the dragons is not mere coincidence I don't have any this business is one with of you, the so get out of my signs place. that Lady Mara is displeased with your constant inebriation. <laughs> Put down your flagons filled with your vile liquids, and embrace the teachings of the Handmaiden of Kine. No, no, Marimov. We talked about this. Talon? Kirava, certainly we can come to some sort of an understanding. Okay. There must be the of the chaos they've sown. They haven't much to discuss. Not Marimov. We've all heard of the dragons and their return. So you're the one. Hmm. You don't look so impressive. Very well, Talon. I'll remove myself from this den of iniquity. Is that confidence I hear? Or is it arrogance? Strange how often they're confused. You have to understand. It's been a long time since Brynjolf sent me anyone I can rely on. Faith. I don't have faith in anyone. Uh. All I care about is cause and effect. Did the job get done and was it done correctly? There's no gray area. <laughs> Head to the Bannered Mare in Whiterun and look for Malus Machius. He'll fill you in on all the details. I don't think I want to look for that guy. Of course. Nothing gets done without my approval in this city. I have the Jarl's ear and the guards in my pocket. Anyone makes trouble for me and I pay a visit to the Thieves' Guild. Make me angry and I contact the Dark Brotherhood. You do well to remember that the next time you make such a stupid observation. Okay. Some layabout named Sabian. Been a thorn in my side for the last few years now. Not a day goes by that I don't regret letting Sabion get as far as he did. 
but he's dead now, I'm pretty sure. He's taken that vile he calls mead to market and a chunk of my profits with it. I can't imagine where he found the gold to take it to market so quickly. Exactly. With Savion in prison, his needery will be forced to close. Then I swoop in and take over the place. No more competition. The Golden Glow estate job has undoubtedly interrupted the supply of honey I need to make my mead. Savion could use this interruption to his advantage and collect a larger share of the market. I can't have that. The Blackbriar family has always been allied with the guild. Our connections with the Empire and within Skyrim make for a perfect fit. I dare say the guild owes its survival as much to my family as it does to its own people. Okay, whatever. One more time, in case I wasn't clear. You butcher this job and you will be sorry. You have some nerve coming back here after what you did to Kirava. What? Depends. Are you thirsty? Hungry? Both? Oh, he has potions. Hmm. Let's see. All of them all him restore stamina. Whatever. Just get out of here. Yeah. Looking for work? I need someone to deliver a message to Sibby Blackbriar. You're a stranger here too, huh? Oh well. I don't have any business with you. Get out of Actually, I think I'll end this here for now, so. Anyways, guys, bye.